who can find a virtuous woman? For her price is far above rubies. Rubies are precious stones consisting of corundum in color varieties. These are highly esteemed as well as sought after commodities. Yet the creator of this vast universe is pronouncing inestimable value on you, woman, by declaring that your worth is far above that of rubies. As we all celebrate International Women's Day, embracing its purpose-driven theme, inspire inclusion. Let us be intentional about our interests in the well-being of other women. Inspire by including all women, men and children in your prayers and in your sphere of influence. Ephesians 6, 18 challenges us to pray always with all prayer and supplication in the spirit and watching thereunto with all perseverance and supplication for all saints. Inspire by nurturing, care for, and encourage the growth and development of other women as well as our gems. Titus 2, 4 to 5, give wise counsel that these older women must train the younger women to love their husbands and their children, to live wisely and be pure, to work in their homes, to do good, and to be submissive to their husbands, inspired by celebrating the success of other women. It involves expressing joy, happiness, or gratitude towards the achievement of something. Romans 12, 15 implores us to rejoice with them that do rejoice and weep with them that weep. Inspire by loving. Love is an intense feeling of deep affection or a great interest and pleasure in something. Show love to all persons as you go through life. In John 30, 34 to 35, we are edified by Jesus himself. A new commandment I give to you, that you love one another just as I have loved you. You also are to love one another. By this, all people will know that you are my disciples if you have love one for another. Inspire by unlocking true potentials. Help other women and gems to unleash the power within, turning their maybes into musts and their fears into faith by creating that ultimate belief in the supreme being and in themselves. Hebrews 13, 16 admonishes us, do not forget to do good and share with others, for with such sacrifices, God is pleased. Inspire by sowing, impart gradually or establish firmly values or principles into the minds of women and gems in order that positive changes can be brought about in their behavior. As promised in 1 Timothy 4, 6, if you point these things out to the brothers and sisters, you will be a good minister of Christ Jesus, nourished on the truths of the faith and of the good teaching that you have followed. Inspire by identifying. When you identify with someone, it causes you to have a connection with them and you can understand them and share their feelings. Identify with God and you will be able to easily identify with other women and gems. Colossians 3, 12 to 40 beseech us. Therefore, as God's chosen people, holy and dearly loved, clothe yourselves with compassion, kindness, humility, gentleness, and patience. Bear with each other and forgive one another if any of you has a grievance against someone. Forgive as the Lord forgave you, and over all these virtues put on love, which binds them all together in perfect unity. 
inspired by overcoming. Look to Jesus, the author and finisher of your faith, who has already equipped you with the requisite tools for succeeding in trampling any difficulty. And because of your victory, other women and gems will be motivated to achieve the same end. In 2 Corinthians 1, 3 to 4, we are told, Blessed be God, even the Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, the Father of mercies and the God of all comfort, who comforted us in all our tribulation, that we may be able to comfort them which are in any trouble by the comfort wherewith we ourselves are comforted of God. Inspire by navigating, plan and direct the course of your life with God's guidance. In so doing, you will be able to take control of your life, thereby being a positive role model for other women and gems. Proverbs 3, 5 to 6, encourage us to trust in the Lord with all of our heart and to lean not on our own understanding. In all our ways acknowledge him and he shall direct our paths. Women, on this International Women's Day, strive to inspire inclusion. Maya Angelou, an American memoirist, poet, and civil rights activist, with conviction declared that each time a woman stands up for herself without knowing it, possibly without claiming it, she stands up for all women. Inspire inclusion. On behalf of the Women's and Adolescents Ministries Department of the Guyana Conference of Seventh-day Adventists, I wish you a happy International Women's Day. May God bless you immensely. And even as you inspire inclusion, be inspired by the invigorating infallibility that God loves you with an everlasting